thank you for clicking my video today you're going to be packing with me i'm traveling very soon in two days with a friend of mine um, i'm not going to tell you location you see it in the next travel vlog i post so stay tuned for that what you can guess a hint is that it's in europe now my box is literally here it's a red antler box i got from ck max i actually got a set of three in covid in covid when i couldn't travel i just went out trying to get myself ready for travel that was like two years ago anyway if you really want to assist me in getting organized i can have a good time on my trip sit back relax and let's pack together my name is Steph and you're welcome to the Metro Gypsy platform. Just finished work and during my lunch break, guess what meal I made? Moi moi. So I'm literally having mine now while I'm going to start packing. Also, today's Valentine's Day. Did you guys get anything for Vals? I did. <laughs> Once I finish packing now, I'm going to start getting ready for dinner because I have dinner tonight and then I'll show you what I'm wearing as well. So let's just get right into this. So obviously, as you know, a very organized human being that I am, when I'm traveling, the first thing I do is to know what I actually want to do. Because obviously, I'm not just going to be going there for a certain amount of days and I just get outfit for those days. No, as a content creator, you have to try and create as well. When I was putting the plan together, my friend was like, please just make sure you're adding clubbing, lounging and everything. I was like, yeah, don't worry. It's not just... But the thing is that when I travel to places, I also want the place to kind of pass through me. So I make sure I do, you know, things that are related to the place, tour the place, get an understanding of the city. I was in TK Maxx and I saw saw these skirts. Tiki Max has a lot of Zara right now. So it just reminded me of like beaches and stuff. So I just got two of the skirts. It's kind of a loose fit. But I think it will fit my friend and I. So I, I just want us to make it real. Maybe at the beach. Fit I got to be honest. I got a lot of um, dresses. Because obviously she's talking about lounging club and everything. So it would be nice to just dress up. I got this dress. It's pretty little thing. It's ruched and it's midi. So I also have another a marble dress like this but that one is nasty girl and is is not rich but it's the same marble print and it's immediate so i obviously wear this for one of our lounges and i'll also use it to create a reel i got this black and white one and yeah this is another outfit that we're going to i'm going to use like when we're going out this one is a nasty girl i really love midi dresses um especially these bodycon ones because they're kind of sexy but it's still really really covered so but it's just that with this marble print a lot of them are not lined so you have to wear something on that i have a white dress that i'll probably wear i wish i had like a chemist that was black and you know long but i don't so i'll probably just take this but then again i have a tank dress and i just think that it would it wouldn't look too tacky so this is nasty girl i love this print like it's so 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 pretty see through again but not that bad it's a random pair of shirts i got from tk max like it's beshka but it's you know full leather i've never had cycle shots like this i'm really really excited to wear this but this one i'm thinking i'll just wear with like a loose tee i'm going for four nights and six days yeah so that's a lot of time to explore the city and relax from my nine to five there's this look i've been wanting to really wear which is all white i decided to get a lounge set that is like all white so this is um ribbed the trousers are not as long as I thought they would be, but yeah, we'll just have to manage it like that. So there's a ribbed um, pair of pants. Then it comes with its white top. This is kind of cropped as well, so I'm really hoping I'll be proper comfortable in this. As I said, I'll link everything. This was from Nasty Girl, and I got it in a 12. The first top I want to wear, that's the Zara skirt I said I got for my friend and I. I want to wear like a tank top, one of those my Zara crop tank tops that always come in handy. For the second um, look for the skirt, I'm thinking to wear this. this is a white short sleeved tie front with collared top and I think it'll be fantastic when I wear it. So I wear it to do the real and I also wear it to make pictures. On a normal day, board day, I can just wear it with jeans as well because I love how it's cropped but at the same time it's like collared with shirt. So it looks a bit serious but it's a crop top. When I was trying to get some things in vintage, just to tell you guys the beauty of, you know, buying and selling on vintage, I got this pair of pants. Where are they from? Okay, they are pretty little thing, but I got them from Vinted. Very palazzo, very free. Like, really looking forward to wearing this because this is one of the pieces that just reminded me of travel at the beginning of this year. Next is one of my favorite pieces, my lazy styling. It's a trouser cord and it's dark floral. Well, it's, yeah, these are flowers actually, so I really, really love them. It's kind of silk in texture and it comes with a top as well. Where's the top? It's tie in front log sleeve just exactly like that white one it just has the same vibe just that is a set with this one so I, this is definitely going to be one of my main 
um, looks for the day. I'm also going to do another outfit from Nasty Girl, but this one is going to be a co-ord, short co-ord. These are the pair of shorts. They kind of look like nighty shorts, I know. And then this is the top. So this is going to be from Nasty Girl and I'll be comparing it to another one from Pretty Little Thing. And this is the Pretty Little Thing. This outfit is just deep. It's so, it's like kilted and it's quite thick. Not thick, thick, crazy, but you know, it's just not easy to just fold easily. But yeah, these are the pair of shots for that one. This is the top. So the top is like a crop jacket. And yeah, I just think it's so different. And I just think the outfit should just look different from what people are usually, you know, used to seeing. Make sure you follow me on Instagram to see when I create all these reels because I'll probably just show you maybe a few seconds when I'm at the hotel doing this or beach or wherever I'm going to be doing them. But to see the actual, you know, result, actually follow me on Instagram at Metro Gypsy. So this is another dress in a marble print. I got this from PLC as well. It's ruched at the bottom and then it's got a belt at the back. The thing about this dress is that this is what I'm going to wear tonight. So you'll probably see this outfit when I'm leaving tonight. I have my Dior tools. I'm taking that one along with me because it's going to be help me carry my tripod. Also, I got another tripod from Amazon. I got this one. My tripod folds, but it doesn't fold as short as this. So I just got this. This came from Amazon today. It comes in black and blue as well as red. While I'm touring, I'm also going to be working so we don't have to disturb the hotel for irons. I just got my steamer. I'm hoping if this kg goes above, I think it's 23, I'm just going to drop this one. Another outfit I'm taking, I've been looking forward to actually shooting content in this two of them from Shapes and Colors, NG. She's a designer based in, right now, I think she's based in Luxem Luxembourg, but she's Nigerian. She's, you know, black, so black owned. This is the first dress. This will probably be, I'm not really sure where I'll be wearing this to, but yeah, it's a beautiful dress. It's the, the print is silk and it's got that detail there it's midi it's in three quarter sleeves s and c is her name from shapes and colors um i also have this kimono so this would definitely come in handy when i'm at the beach it's really see-through obviously the steamer <laughs> it would definitely need the steamer because of the way the fabric is it creases really really fast so i just love how the lining is black it makes it look more prestigious and yeah it's polka dotted but you know polka dotted with like gold and light blue one of the times i worked with yes style i got swimwear and this is the top so the top is also very covered like the long sleeve um top and then it's got the cups and it's got a zipper in front. It's got this like massive hat, obviously for the beach paroles. Got a lot of scarves because I'm not sure what when I do even have the energy. There's no time to be honest because I worked today. I have just tomorrow and then next day I'm traveling. So I just got these scarves just to, you know, rock the scarf with the glasses look when any day. Well, I just packed all of them. I have like three of this kind of bags. This one I got from Love Island. I think one of the first two seasons or something when they were doing like this kind of bag from the Love Island website I also got this water bottle so I put the footwear for now in my carry-on just because obviously it can be as heavy as you want to you want to be as long as the carry-on goes into that they are measuring thing let me show you a bit of the footwear I Zara um, slides in white I have this one in black slides as well I'm taking this pair of black heels I might I have the white ones as well I'm thinking I might take these or even the neon ones I rocked in spring last year. I'm sure you those one. I might just add it if there's space. For my handbags, obviously I told you about the dear one. I'll probably take a few smaller bags. I was going to wear something like this, but just said overdone. So I'm going to wear this Polaroid jumper and then my joggers. I'll get ready for dinner in about one hour and show you my outfit. Been sitting eyes wide open behind us for walls, hoping you would call. It's just a cruel existence like there's no point hoping at all The next day Yeah, right now I'm at the airport I'm here to meet up Uju, she actually landed in London yesterday and her luggage, you know, was not <laughs> brought forth so yeah they call them today so the luggage is here but she gets in like two days and she's traveling tomorrow so yeah she had to come so i'm just hoping i'll find her because her internet is not um her whatsapp is not delivering this is my outfit of the day lovely jacket <laughs> jacket is so suitable for travel 
like all the cities they were. For you cross guys look at your sideways. I say hi to the vloggy vloggy. Hi vlogs. <laughs> yeah, so we're so at the airport. Um, I didn't bring this thing out again. I just sat at the cafe and she came out, and they were here now with the taxi. But we still have to go shopping at the mall, so we're going to go Westfield now. We have dinner today by 6 15 with our friend. Yeah, instead of chinos. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. So we have done what and what now? A monkey. Is that monkey? When do you enter monkey? Anyway, she's still holding one back. And I'm still holding the river island. And then I went to Mango. So right now we're at the trying to get kids' shoes. And I got this pants from Mango, guys. I wanted to buy it online um, some two days ago, but all the, all the mango did it be like it was up like next day because like you call me three days, you call me four days and stuff. So yeah, I got this. So it's this um, pants that folds in the front, just like this. I'm just hoping the waist wouldn't be too big for me. You know what? I'll probably do a how to style because the um, trousers are really funky. It comes in black as well, as I said, but I got this pair so that when I wear a black top, it really pops like the folding thing. Yeah, so I'll probably do a health style with just like simple um, tops as a real. We are done now and we are hungry. And are you tired? She's had like a crazy set of days this past day. Yeah, the past days have been crazy. So yeah, we're going to pass just here. I said, it to that. The next day. I is in the room. Hope I make it out of here. I even watch planes like you know mm. taking off and oh, I really really know. Go I said no, I'll just take my picture down there. Mm -hmm. okay. we'll go there. This is oh, more popular. Yeah. Everything is everywhere. I, I wasn't sure you liked this. Yeah, I just, I like okay, that's true. The yeah. point of the story was even what now said yesterday. Mm -hmm. So I was like oh, ah, that's your place they do scrum master training mm -hmm. and then she was like they do BAPM scrum master is so you decide which one you want to go mm -hmm. it's the same lecture that covers everything to be honest mm -hmm. and I was like okay what do you try this they said how about product owner I said okay let me see because now I'm not even tired of all the names because I know really everything is actually under that BA training you can just like yeah she now said the best anyway is change analyst Okay. I'm trying to do. I'm trying to do this. Uh, this um, TV game show. We're trying to shoot. Okay, where? In Nigeria, there. Oh. That one. Oh, that's the about. Yeah. Let me you. Uh, a pilot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I this space, my last person. Okay. Oh, but I need a space. Oh. Okay, it's so under here. Now words have become a part of us. It's how we express ourselves. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Christmas present. Probably. Love me. That game show does exist. Six contestants. Six rounds. Three million naira up for grabs. It's a game show that deals with words and their synonyms. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Money is the Word. So this is just a common cup. Okay. But is it you can now know what the game show is? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's finish our game show. How many episodes? So for the first season. It's supposed to be two episodes per season. Jesus, that's a lot. Yeah, How many probably, episodes did you show you want? That's what we're looking for. Spons yeah, investors. Yeah, we're looking for investors or sponsors or TV houses partner with you. Or, you know. So what to do it? Why I want to do it is because that's why I'm not trying to distract myself with scrum or do oh, anything. I want to first. Be sure. Who has the wheel? You and your sister? No. It's just me. Uh, me and my producer will be doing all the movement. Okay. Yeah. With my IP. Wow. That's fine. It was, it was something I thought about like, you know, how many years ago? When I was in America, I used to watch a lot of game shows. If you had told anybody would have told me that I was doing you shoes, this and I'll say they lie. Yeah. But when they saw Promo Court, everybody's eyes were like, ah, you see yeah, exactly. you're looking so that was just how I just had to push myself to that point to just do that part. Let me not just because something I just listen to me, do go and do this thing, do go and do this thing, go and do this thing. Like I've been sitting on it for too long. He's like how many years? Even himself was like I have just shot five years. I've been how many years since? What's it going to be called? Money is the word. Money is the word. A few moments later. I just finished editing the video and I realized there was no outro or intro. So yeah, you passed with me yesterday and then we have now come to where I am traveling to with a friend of mine. So I met my friend at the airport. We checked in together. Everything was really seamless. And then guess what? With my gold card, I was able to go to the executive lounge, have breakfast day. But even I have my bath out, I've had my bath. But yeah, it was such a good time, so I decided to show you guys a bit of things. So that's literally what you saw being at the executive lounge. Yeah, even um, when I was trying to go into, when we found the gate, and I was trying to get into the plane, there was a long queue, but because of the gold card, I could go to the front and go in really quickly. So yeah, it was such a lovely experience at BA Terminal 3. Funny enough, I've never flown BA with Terminal 3. Anytime it's BA, it's always Terminal 5. Maybe it's because I'm always going to... Niger. But yeah, today's experience was really nice. I thought to share it with you guys and just end this video here. And I've ended the video with a um, compact with me, but nothing much really happened today. So I said, you know what, let's just add today into the mix and then end the video. So tomorrow, you obviously know where I am, where we are with my friends. And yeah, we'll tell you what the itinerary is right now. I can't tell you because you might guess. Okay, let me just tell you today we're supposed to do the Gothic Walk. That's all I'm going to say, but we couldn't. So we're going to fix it into tomorrow after the tour activities of tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching this video. Subscribe if you haven't and click the bell right beside the subscribe button so you get notifications every time I post. Drop a comment because I love to read from you. Share this video with your friends, your family, and your enemies. I'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>